Yes, it's me. I know. What a pleasant surprise. Yeti sitting. Next stop, Yeti Village. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? <laughs> Bartleby, we just left. But I can't blame you for being excited. I can't wait to babysit the Yeti triplets. Me too. <laughs> yeah, three Yeti babies equals three times the fun. Which is why I packed all my toys. I just didn't know if they'd be into squeaky toys. Or tin foil balls or silly faces. <laughs> I'm sure the Yeti babies will love your toys. Thanks for bringing them, Bartleby. And thank you, Griselda, for coming along to help. Oh, it's no problem. After all, I am a pro when it comes to babies. Look, I brought my How to Raise a Fruki book. Written by the most fabulous writer I know, me. <sighs> a whole chapter on baby talk? I'm fluent. Listen. Is little baby Bartleby excited to see the Yeti Weddies? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's good, yeah. <laughs> you are a baby expert. Mm-hmm. I raised Fruki all by myself, and he turned out perfectly. Mm. Babysitting is going to be easy. Right, well, we just have to remember, though, not to actually sit on the babies, okay, Grizz? No baby sitting. Look, I have a whole chapter on how not to sit on the babies. Last stop, Yeti Village. We're here! This is going to be so great! We are so ready to babysit your fuzzy little triplets. I've got my fruity training book. And I brought all my toys. Hi, Hi Snick. Hi. Babies. Babies. <laughs> <laughs> Yuck. Fluff. Aww, they're almost cute enough to be princesses. <laughs> The babies just had their nap. I love Mumbleberry! And they had some Mumbleberries. And now it's playtime! Ah. And now they're ready for playtime! Did someone say playtime? <laughs> nope, not that, not that. Nope, nope, yes, yes! Hmm, what should we play? Fetch? Chase your tail round and round? Smother Bartleby with kisses? Brookie can play that for hours. Whoa, 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 whoa! Don't you, don't! Aww. No! Bye! See you at sunset! We'll make sure they're in bed by then. All right, cuties. Who's ready for some true tickles? Hey, where'd they go? <laughs> <laughs> I am Grok! Correction, I had Grok. <laughs> Bloof, nobody touches the crown. <laughs> Okay, Grok, that's a good girl. Uncle Barnaby's arms are getting a little tired. I'm just gonna put you down for a second. Okay, who wants to go for a kitty back ride? Huh? What? <laughs> there you are, you silly girl. Wait a ninja catch, B. <laughs> Roll over. Shake a paw. I think we should take these little bundles of fun outside. Where things are less breaky. <laughs> Who wants to go for a little carriage ride? <laughs> Wait, we need toys. My fruity schmuckums never leaves home without his favorite chew toy. <laughs> What do you have? Well, let's see. I got the uh, squeaky mousey. No. Uh, yarn ball. A any takers? Hmm. Tough crowd. Let's see. <laughs> I know. You can't go wrong with a tinfoil ball. <gasps> the babies! They love to throw them. Playground.
ground. Okay, who wants a push from Uncle Bartleby? After he has a rest. Bloof, that is such a cute pose. Okay, now stay. I've got to face bubble this. Ready? Say I'm a cutie. Uh, uh, huh? Uh, 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 uh. Silly Floof, come down here. The only thing cuter than a princess is a princess with a Yeti baby. <laughs> <laughs> What else is fun? A nice walk by the river. <laughs> You're right, Drew. That sounds way less jumpy and crashy. See? Isn't this fun? <laughs> I think she wants to sniff around the tree. Fruki loves sniffing trees. And then he... <gasps> Do that! Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, thank you, Grok, but we should put that down now, okay? Uh, uh, Wait! I meant put it back where it was! <laughs> Good boy, Floof. Now show Grok how to play nice with trees. A lot of water. We'd better go find those triplets and see what they're up to. I'm sure there's something about all of this in my How to Train Your Fruity book. Make it look so easy! This is nothing like training for you! <laughs> we need wish help. Cumulo! <laughs> that was close. Thanks, Cumulo! Griselda, will you be okay keeping an eye on the triplets? Totally. I'm in control, as always. Great, we'll be right back. To the wishing tree, please. Go, go, Cumulo! Z! Hi, True. Hey, Bartleby. How did the babysitting go? We've got a big problem. The Yeti triplets went rolling off in their carriage. And then we found them, but then they started pulling out trees. And the river got clogged and the whole Yeti village is flooded and Griselda's just floating there. And the babies are definitely not sleeping. And Erg and Snake will be home any minute now. Unbalanced equations! That is a big problem. But sit and have a think. Okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? Well, the triplets are safe, so first we need to stop the flood in Yeti Village. Good idea. You should tackle the biggest problem first. 
There's so much water that everything's floating. Yeah, and running on logs is way harder than it looks. It is. The triplets make it look so easy. They're impossible to catch, so we need a way to round them up. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishing tree. Now let's see what the Wishipedia says about their powers. This is Grapplo. Hey ho, Grapplo. Ah. Grapplo has mighty grabbing power. He can grab onto anything and lift even the heaviest objects. Oh, oh yeah, ha ha. Perfect. Grapplo, you can help us unblock the river. Oh. Your next wish is Hugsy. Oh, yeah. This is a fun one. Hugsy! Hugsy loves wrapping anyone in super tight hugs. Who doesn't love hugs? Hugs! Hugs. <laughs> Hugsy, you can help us round up the triplets. <laughs> and last, but definitely not least, we have Twisty. A super strong wish. Twisty! Great to see you again. <laughs> this one is a force of nature. Twisty can twist up anything, even a strong tornado. That's incredible! I'm just not sure how twisting could help with a flood or baby Eddies, but I can't wait to figure it out. Oh. <laughs> Zoo zip zap, wishes in my pack. <laughs> Let's go fix Yeti Village! Thanks, Z! Bye, Z! You're welcome! Good luck! Good job watching the babies, Griselda. Oh, no problem. You know, I always knew I was a great babysitter. But now I know I'm a fantastic carriage sitter, too. <laughs> Time for some wish power, True. You got it. Cunio, take us to the bridge, please. For my first wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Grapplo! Wish come true! Hi, Grapplo! See that bridge over there? Oh uh ho! -huh. There's a big tree that's stuck underneath. Can you grab onto it and pull it out? Uh -huh. Great. Okay, Grapplo, get into position. Hey ho! -huh. Now, pull! Oh, hey, ha ha! Oh, oh. Hey, hey. Keep trying, Grapplo! Oh, yeah. oh. Yay! Hey, look! The water's going down! I just kissed the ground. Bye, Cubilo! See ya, buddy! Grapplo, that was really impressive. Up top, Grapplo! Ha-ha! <laughs> 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 I'm okay! Cutest plumber ever! Now tuck yourself in. Okay, now to round up those babies and get them home before sunset. Where are those cute Yeti babies anyway? Huh? <laughs> that didn't really answer my question. Which way did they go? Yurkin flew for swinging over there, and there, and over there. 
Came from over there. <laughs> okay. Okay. Don't worry, babies. Uncle Bartleby will get you down. Um, true. How is Uncle Bartleby going to get them down? Hmm. <laughs> we'll give them something that babies love. Hugs. Time for my second wish. Zip zap zoo. I choose you. Wake up, Hugsy! <laughs> Wish come true! Okay, Hugsy, these little yetis need your super huggy power. Oh, yeah! Uh, uh, uh. Now's your chance, Hugsy! It's Cuddle O'Clock! <laughs> <laughs> Let go now. Aw, <laughs> thank you, Grog. And now to buckle you in to make sure you stay put. <laughs> Here comes your. Okay, Hugsy. Time for round two. <laughs> Hi, Yurk. <laughs> that was fun, wasn't it? That's two babies down and one to go. <laughs> Hope your snuggle supply is high, Hugsy. <laughs> no need, True. Hugsy can sit this one out. My book has a whole chapter on what to do when your Fruki's off his leash. Come here, Floof. You be a good baby Yeti. <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. When training your Fruki, offer treats as a reward. <laughs> I've got some yummy snacky wackies. Huh? <laughs> gotcha! Oh. Such good yetis. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Thanks for everything, Hugsy. <laughs> now tuck yourself in. <laughs> well, that's that. Now let's get these yeti babies home in bed. <laughs> They're getting sleepy already. See, I knew babysitting was going to be easy. Yeah, it's a good thing you brought your book, Griselda. And bringing your toys was a great idea, too, Bartleby. We're a pretty good babysitting team. Oh, what a wonderful sunset. I love the way it feels on my face. Huh? Sunset? And oh, look, there's Erg and Snick returning from their big day out. <gasps> Erg and Snick? I really hope they don't see that big pile of trees over there. It's messy. Pile of trees? Oh, no, we can't leave the Yeti village like this. Cleaning up trees is not in my babysitting book. Griselda Bartleby, you need to get those Yeti babies back in bed before Erg and Snick get home. But True, who's going to clean up that mess? I'll take care of those trees. Okay, okay True, we're, we're on, on it. it. It's time for my third wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Twisty. Wish come true! <laughs> Hi, Twisty. We need your help, and fast. You see all those trees over there? We need to clean them up before Mama and Papa Yeti get home. I know you can twist up a tidy tornado to lift them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Better hurry up. Twist, twisty. <laughs> okay, twisty, let's put those trees down. Join Bartleby and 
and Griselda. I'm sure they have the triplets snug in their beds by now. <laughs> Okay, Twisty, now's our chance! <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Great job, Twisty! Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> Zoo Zip Zap wishes in my pack! Yeah! <laughs> 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 us on our toes. I hope you two had a lovely time. We had such a fun day with your little triplets. Whoa, boy, they sure do know how to play. <laughs> and good thing I was here because absolutely nothing went wrong. Here's my card. You got something for us? Oh, you shouldn't have. It was our pleasure. Love is silly. <gasps> Frozen Sasuni juice balls! Woo! Thank, thank you so, so much. much! To the best babysitting team ever! Aww! <laughs> <laughs> the Big Green Bounce! Can I look now? How about now? Aw, oh, can I please? Okay, can I please, 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 please look? Okay! Open your eyes. True. That is the most... I mean, it's just so... How did you... Okay, I have no idea what this is. What is it? It's my invention for the Maker Shaker Expo. I call it the I Heart You Bubblegram. It's magnificent. I love it. Watch this. Wait for it. Wow. Are those sugar glitter swirls? <laughs> <gasps> a heart? For me? Even better! A heart you can eat! You sure know the way to my heart, True. <clears throat> You're gonna win the sunshine ribbon for sure! Thanks, Bee. Winning would be nice, but I'm just excited to see what everyone else has made. True! I just heard about this maker, shaker, whatever thingy. You need to help me win the sunshine ribbon! Griselda, you can win it without my help. You always make cool stuff, like your giant Grisbot. No, 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 true. <laughs> or maybe a mini Grisbot? Something less stompy. Grisbots are so passe. I've been trying to come up with an idea, but the Grismos are being so loud carving my wall of me. Didn't quite capture my. I don't know what. Do it again. Talk later, True. Oh, what's this? Green crystals? Gross. I only work with pink. Ugh. Bouncy green crystals? Now that I can work with. I need you to. Okay. I need you to make me an invention. A thousand silver salutations! Welcome to the Maker Shaker Expo! <laughs> the winner takes home the spectacular Sunshine Ribbon! <gasps> now, don't forget to vote for your favorite invention. Oh, that means me too. Indigo Inventions! True, this is remarkable. What is it? This is my I Heart You Bubblegram! Ooh, how does it work? Allow me to show you. <laughs> Terrific topaz! Oh, and a snack, too. <laughs> Lovely lavender! I bubble heart you, too. Now, shall we see what everyone else has come up with? Yes! yes! Let's go! 
Mellow yellow. A soothing rock fountain? Look how the water comes up right through the rocks. Hi, everybody. Hi, Mila. What's your invention? Have you ever thought that one high five just isn't enough? Always. Then you'll love this. Presenting the high five hat for when you're feeling under fived. Spring loaded high fives? One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> That's five times the fun. Who wants to try bubbly Zazuni juice? A juice bubbler? I have to see how this works. Oh, this'll be fine. I just push the button here, the bubbles bubble up, and they come out here. Tickles. <laughs> Purple pardons. Cheers. Cheers. Excuse, Excuse you. you. <laughs> <laughs> Why, hello, little helpers. What did you make? Very impressive. I've got my own personal cleaning machine. <laughs> That's also very impressive. Ooh. Bee, it's Griselda's invention. Let's go check it out. Get a bouncy bling bling, and you get a bouncy bling bling, and you get a bouncy bling bling. Yay! Thanks, Griselda. Wow, they're so boingy. Excuse me, would you please sign my bling bling? Of course. <laughs> bouncy bling bling, invented by yours truly, Princess Griselda. Griselda, can you show me how your machine works? Works? I have no idea how it works. Details are so not my thing. Details are exactly my thing. Okay, let's see now. First, the Grismos carry the green crystals up the ladder and put them into the hopper. Then it seems like the crystals get all smooshed up into a green goo. Right, and that green goo gets rolled up into a ball, which comes out the front. What was that? Green water spews into the river. Hmm, this doesn't look quite right. I don't think this is normal. We should go ask Griselda. Griselda, did you know that? I'm the best inventor. Yes, smiley face. Now, what did you want me to sign? Actually, B and I were just at the back of your machine, and it looks like... You were saying how cool the back of my machine is? Well, actually, there's green... Polka dots on these bling-blings? I don't normally go for green, but these dots are too adorbs. Winky face! So, are we gonna tell her about the green water thingy? I don't know, B. Griselda's really enjoying this. I don't want to ruin it for her. Come on, let's go see who's going to win the sunshine ribbon. Yeah, maybe green water is good for the river. I am delighted to announce the best invention of the Maker Shaker Expo. The winner of the sunshine ribbon is. Please, 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 please. please. do it. I'd like to thank everyone who helped me, but since I did it all myself, I'll just thank me. <laughs> Where did you get the idea for these bouncing bling blings? They're fantastically fun and so pretty. I based them mostly on myself. Griselda! Griselda! Seen this before? Or this? And especially this! Bling bling 
Blings are really big. Those aren't Bling Blings. Those are people. <laughs> oh. Perplexing pistachio. This water's green. <laughs> Rainbow King, are you okay? Oh, I'm fine. Just a little wet. And round. And... Oh, oh, bouncy! Okay, <laughs> what is going on? People are turning into bouncy bling blings. Come again? It happened to the Rainbow King after he was splashed by that green river water. <gasps> Griselda's machine! We need to stop this before everyone turns into bling blings. Then let's ask Griselda to turn off the machine. Hey, Griselda! <laughs> We can't. Why not? She's having such a fun time with this. Also, she doesn't know how the machine works, so telling her wouldn't help. Smiley face. So how do we stop the water? Well, we know how the machine works. We can fix it. Here, grab on. <laughs> Why put a turny thing on here if it won't turn? <laughs> ah! Uh-oh. We've got to stop this. We need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! To the wishing tree, please, Cumulo! <laughs> Zee, we have a huge problem! True, Bartleby! Have you seen these bouncy bling blings? Aren't they fun? They are fun but people are turning into them. Wow, that's super fun. But you seem worried. Explain, please. Griselda's machine is turning all the water green and some people got splashed by it. And then they became polka dotted. And it gets worse, they inflated. And then they started bouncing and bouncing and bouncing. Just, just like the bouncy bling blings. Wandering wormholes. But sit and have a think. Okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? Well, Griselda's really proud of her invention, so we need a way to stop the green water without having to tell her. Right, and I'm sure you can with some wish help. We also need a way to unboing the boinging citizens. They'll keep bouncing forever if we don't get them back to normal. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. <sighs> wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> wishing tree, share with me. Wishes are spectacular, True. Let's see what the Wishipedia says about them. First stop is Tie Tie. This wish can tie itself into all sorts of knots. Great! Tie Tie, you can help tie up our loose ends. Tie Tie! Oh, Bumbershoot has fantastic parachute powers. Bumbershoot can float you down to the ground safely from any height. Bumbershoot, you can help catch the bouncing citizens. Uh-huh, Bumbershoot. <gasps> this is one of my favorite wishes. Cubigly. Great to see you again, Cubigly. Cubigly. Cubigly has a jiggly, gelatinous body that can absorb anything into it. Hmm, I don't know how Cubigly can help stop the green water or the boinging citizens, but I'm sure we can put your gooey center to good use. <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Thanks, Z. See you later. <laughs> now let's put a stop to this green water. Time for my first wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Ty Ty. Wish come true. Hi, Ty-Ty. I need you to give
give the pipe a big hug. Yes! Bye-bye, green water. Where's a high five hat when you need one? Sides feel jiggly. I'm tired. I don't know how to bounce anymore. Indigo insomnia. This is ruining my <laughs> royal nap. Hang in there. We're going to figure this out. Oh, Cumulo! Take us up, please. Whoa. Never get tired of that, Cumulo. Time for my second wish. Zip Zap Zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Bumper Shoe! Bumper Wish come true. Hi, Bumper Shoe. I need your help to catch and hold down those boingy citizens. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Bumper Are you sure this is gonna work? Only one way to find out. Roll over, Cumulo. Woohoo! Ah! It worked! Everyone stopped bouncing! Oh, great! Thank you for unbouncing us, True. I couldn't have done it without Bumbershoot. You were super helpful. Now tuck yourself back in. Okay, now stay put. If you move, you'll start bouncing again. Um, True, I think Tai Tai's about to untai Tai. Oh no. Okay, it's finally time to tell Griselda to turn her machine off. My tummy is all jiggly. Bubbly is a Zuni juice to calm your belly storm. Hmm, that just might settle it. <laughs> Excuse me. Huh, ten percent less jiggly. Make that twenty percent. What's your name? Here you go. Puppy face. Like a job for a stealth kitty nafty master. Follow me. Almost there. <laughs> so, how many fishy poop crackers for me and the friend to get to see the princess next? ran through the machine. Bouncing bling-blings weren't the only thing that came out. Green water gushed out of the back and into the river, turning it green. The green water ran through the city, and any citizens that touched it blew up like bling-blings. They started bouncing higher and higher and higher and higher, so we had to jump off Cumulo to catch them with Bumbershoot, which was super scary. Then we ran to tell you to turn off the machine, but the Grismos said no, and we said please, and the Grismos said no, and we said pretty please, and then they said no, so we waited in line until it was our turn to see you, and we said, Griselda, you're turning people into bling-blings! <sighs> Nice job, B. Um, what's happening? It's gonna blow! Everyone die! <laughs> I'm... I'm... Coca Dotty! I'm Bloaty! What's happening, 
to me! She's way bouncier than the others. Cumulo! After that bouncy, boingy princess! She's headed straight for Boing Boing Lagoon! Whoa. I'm your real rescue! Ah! We need a way to catch her! Something with the jiggly gooey center! Mmm, sounds yummy. It really does. It. Let's talk in more saving! Take us down, Cumulo! It's time for my third wish. Zip zap do I choose you! Wake up, Cubiggly! Wish come true! Hi, Cubiggly! <laughs> Griselda's going to land here any second. We need you to catch her. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 this way. Back that way. I got it. Whoa! Just a bit more. No, my luck. Right with you, Drew. Okay. Here. Whoa! No, 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 no. It worked. Yes. Nice work, Q Biggly. Now let's get Griselda back to the expo. We still need to unboy everyone. Now what? Princesses are rarely polka dotty and never inflated and absolutely never green. Don't worry, Griselda. We just need to figure out how to unboing the boinginess. Wow. You're not boingy anymore? No. A bubbly zazuni burp did the trick. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, I can do that trick. Uh. Excuse me. Farmer Mosser, juice ball me, please. One juice ball coming at you. Uh, huh. mm -hmm. What's up? Why aren't you burping? Are you kidding? Burping is very unprincessly. But if you don't burp, you'll stay like that forever. I will do many things, but I will never. Uh... Pardon me. Well, I won't be doing that ever again. I'm me again! Oh, oh, Thanks, Q Biggly. You too, Ty Ty. You were both super helpful. Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! You're welcome, Griselda. Oh, and about my machine. I'm sorry it caused all that trouble. I'm sorry too, Griselda. I should have told you about the green water in the first place. Oh, I really will miss all that selfie taking and autograph signing. If only there was a way to fix the green water problem. Hold on, I have an idea. It worked! The little helper's cleaning machine did the trick. You're a genius, True. Thanks, Bartleby. It sure is nice to have everything back to normal. Next, everything back to normal, face. Princess Grizzbot! Froakie, you locked us out on the balcony by mistake. Think of a way to get us back inside. And while you're in deep thought, I'll see if we can climb down from here. I could call Tree for help. No, I don't want to. But I kind of have to. But I don't want to. I could, but I won't. Hi, True. Hi, Griselda. I'm kind of stuck on my balcony right now. I could totally get down myself. But if you're bored, I thought you might like to help. We'll be right there. Icy Pops will have to wait, B. <gasps> Just kidding. Good one! Ah, you had me totally. <laughs> Still trapped on a balcony here. We're on our way, Griselda. Griselda! <laughs> <laughs> huh? <gasps> Hop into Floto! <sighs> Why do I have to do all of the hard work? <laughs> Thanks, 
Floto. You deserve some rest. I really could have gotten down by myself. I just thought it would be fun to have a play date, you know? Oh, my. Thank you. Calling True was my idea. <laughs> <laughs> True was amazing. I can hear you. Can it true? Can it true? Can it true? You must love all those cheers. Who's amazing? I'm glad they're happy, but I just like to help. Sure, helping is probably good, but all that clapping, that's why you help, right? Nope, I just like helping. Oh. Yay! I don't get it. Sure, everybody cheers for True, but she has those amazing wishes to help her help people. Do I have anything as amazing as wishes? Well, do I? You? Grismos? Hey, you're right. True has wishes, but I've got Grismos. And I have just the job for you. Wishes. Thank you, Grismos! I can't believe I just thanked the Grismos. Come on, Perky! Use the trap door! <laughs> Royalty away! Oh. Rainbow City, look at me! I'm as helpful as can be! Oh. Oh. Clap your hands, say hooray! Thank Griselda, yeah! Me! With Princess Grisba, you will see these three wishes aren't for me. Clap your hands, see hooray! Think Griselda, yes, that's me! Stomping here, stomping there, Grisba save you everywhere! Giant robots are the coolest heroes of the Now's our chance. Have no fear. Grizzbot is here. <laughs> thanks, giant robot man. <laughs> no need for thanks. You're welcome. Is that cheering for me? <laughs> Don't worry. Grizzbot's here to save the day. I know. Yes, I know. I'm amazing. But don't stop. Don't forget to tell everyone about your new hero. You've never had a lunch like this, Beef. An all-around, round lunch where everything is round. Rolly fruit, crunch roll balls, globy pie, and your favorite, Suzuni juice balls. If it's round, it's going down in my belly. That's also round. Something's happening outside. Griselda? You look different. Did you change your hair? Oh, you noticed. True. Oh, funny running into you here on this street. You know I live here, Griselda. You visit me all the time. Perfect. Then you can just kick back at home. Have a nap. Finish our lunch. Because you and your wishes can take the day off. Princess Grisbot is on helper duty. Um, thanks? Oh, it's nothing. It'll be a breeze. My house! Oops. There. Good as new! 
Do we say goodbye to the Rainbow Kingdom now or wait until after she's broken it? If Griselda wants to help people, that can only be a good thing, right? Uh-huh, yeah, um, yeah, for sure, for, for sure. So nice to people. Uh, ahem, bendy straw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No rolling off the table now. <sighs> well, at least it didn't roll. Why? I thought she wanted to do good deeds. These deeds are not good. I agree. Dancing like that is not good for anybody. That's not Griselda. That's Faruki. That dog does not have a license to drive a giant princess-shaped robot. Come on, B. Ah! Which way did it go? True! I simply cannot find my fabulous princess Grizzbot. Never mind. <coughs> Fruki! <coughs> Sweetie Muffin! You have to come down from there! Ah! Fruki! Yetis, of course. You're big and strong. Do you think you can stop the giant robot for us? are great at playing tetherball. <laughs> eh, not so great at robot stopping. Princess Grisbot is too big for us to stop by ourselves. We need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! Take us to the wishing tree, please, Cumulo. <laughs> What a pleasant surprise. See, there's a giant Princess Grizzbot on the loose, and we need some wish help. Fast. <gasps> Psst. True. Don't tell the wishes I'm here. Huh? <laughs> What's with the stand, Easy? It keeps the wishes company when I'm not around. Your flat Z fell a little flat. Z. <laughs> flat Z. Back to the drawing board. And back to your copies, please, wishes. <laughs> Was there something you needed help with, True? Yes, yes, True needs help. There's a problem with the Grizzbot. <laughs> Princess Grizzbot, the fabulous giant robot my Grizzmo's made for me. Giant robot? Yep, and it's kind of, sort of. A lot out of control. Hmm, I'm sure we can find a solution. Let's have a sit and think about this. Griselda? I don't sit on mushrooms. Then why are we all sitting at a time like this anyway? It helps us think things through. Anyway, the Grisbot is out of control with Fruki stuck inside. 
It's starting to wreck things around Rainbow City. How do you plan to fix the problem? Well, I need some wish help to stop the Grizzbot from stomping around. But I also want to keep Rainbow City and Fruki safe. My Fruki Wolfgums get so cranky when he misses his belly rubs. I'm sure the wishing tree can help. Mm. With the Grizzbot, not a belly rub. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. I guess it was a little amazing. A little? Okay, a lot amazing. These are very interesting wishes. Let's look them up in the Wishopedia. Oh, it's amazing! Thanks. Your first wish is Blue Boo. It makes a coating of glue so sticky strong, almost anything will stick to it. It'll have to be really strong if it's gonna hold Princess Grizzbot. Your second wish is bring it. It's a powerful <laughs> magnet wish that can pull any object made of metal towards it. You mean like my Princess Grizzbot? Don't you get a scratch on her. <laughs> <laughs> Your third wish is zillion. It can take one thing and <laughs> make it into lots and lots of that thing. So, if I had a diamond... I could make it into lots of diamonds! Or... We could use it to help stop Princess Grizzbot somehow. Oh, that. Mm. Sure. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Oh. <laughs> Good luck, True. Go grab that Grizzbot. You know... It could be so much more dazzling in here, with a little glitter, some jewels... No thanks. Thanks, cutie owl! <laughs> <laughs> My Grizzbot! Ah! Ah, look out! Ah! Oh. Ah! Ah! Oh, I think Fruki heard me. Now's our chance. Let's see if Glue Boo can make Princess Grizzbot stick around. Zip, zap, zoo. I choose you. Wake up, Glue Boo. <laughs> Wish come true. <laughs> Hi, Glue Boo. Are you ready to help? Mm-hmm. Then let's make this road super sticky. Perfect. Is now a stuck bot. Princess stuck bot. <gasps> <gasps> you mean Princess I'm stuck bot? with your outfit at all. Huh? <laughs> Poor Bartleby! I need to slow down that Grisbot, and I have just the wish to do it. Zip, zap, zoo, I cheat you! Wake up, bring it! Wish come true! Are you ready to help? <laughs> okay, bring it. Show me how much metal you can pull towards you. 
Slow down! Ninja Kitty Dodge! I need an extra hand. I'll give you two. Along with some paw power! We're doing it! Bring it! Come on! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> Guess you used up all your power. Thanks, bring it. Uh. Thanks for your help too, Glue Boo. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <gasps> is Zillion. He can multiply anything. But how can we use that to stop Princess Grisbot? It's not the robot we need to stop. It's Fruki. But what can we multiply that Fruki really likes? Well, he loves me, of course. And squeaky toys. And me. Bartleby. That's it. Fruki loves you. Giving him more of you to love will get him to come out, stop the Princess Grisbot, and save Griselda's castle. A little drool never hurt anyone. And the world can always use more Bartleby. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Cumulo. Are you ready to be more cats than you've ever been before? Yep. Set my Bartleby's free! Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! <laughs> Wake up, Zillion! Ooh. Wish come true! Zillion, can you make us a few more Bartlebees? <laughs> Thanks. This won't hurt, will it? <laughs> Not a bit. <gasps> what? I'm three, three times, times more handsome than I thought. thought. Okay, Bartlebees. Get in front of the Grisbot mm -hmm. so Fruki can see all three of you. Got it! Fruki, over here! Who's got kisses for Bartleby? Here, Fruki, Fruki, Fruki! <laughs> it's not stopping. Uh, can you ninja cats get me up there? One, two, three! Ninja cats, go! Bees. <laughs> I speak for all of us when I say, no problem. Come on, Fruki. Come on. Good, Fruki. Uh-oh. The Grizzbot isn't stopping. Uh, here, Bartleby. Take Fruki down. Gotcha. Cat's rule. Bartleby's a cool. Fruki! you go! Fruki's toy out of here. Oh, my Fruki's going to get stomped on if someone doesn't do something. Me, I have to do something. Grizzbot's gonna crash! Abandoned bot! Griselda! You oh. saved Fruki! That was fabulous? Yeah, I was pretty great, wasn't I? <sighs> but nobody was around to see me do it except for you guys. No, oh, but how do you feel? Actually, really good. For some reason, Huh. 
I could get used to this. <gasps> Princess Grace bodies destroyed! Oh well, I'll just have my Grismos build me another one. No! Kidding! I'll have them build a giant statue of me instead. They're a lot less stompy. La, 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 la. Da, 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 da. Ready to have Zillion turn you back into just one Bartleby? Bartleby? <clears throat> yeah, uh, not yet. I want to let Fuki finish with the other me's first. Please don't. <laughs> Super duper dance party! Yay balloons! Ah! Oops, sorry, True. <laughs> it's okay, Bartleby. We have lots of other decorations to put up that won't pop. Phew! Thanks, True. And when we're done, the Coliseum is going to look super. Super duper for the Rainbow Kings. Super, super duper, duper dance, dance party. party. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for starting the decorating, but it's time to let a professional party planner take it from here. That's me. And my decorating won't be the only thing worth seeing at this party. You are a really good dancer, Griselda. I know. And when we're done setting up and the party's in full swing, every creature everywhere will know it too. Yay, playtime! <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're having fun. Now stop drooling on me. Here, let me help. <laughs> Thanks for the dance, True. <laughs> My pleasure, B. True, hello! How's the setup coming for my super duper dance party? Great, Your Majesty. We're almost done decorating. And best of all, DJ Bingo Bango will be coming soon to spin some tunes! Tickle me pink! All eyes in the kingdom will be on him. All eyes? Here's my chance. True. W would you mind running down to the transit station and bringing him back here? Of course, Your Majesty. I'd be happy to go. If she wasn't so busy with all these decorations. But don't worry, Rainbow King. I'll go get Wingo Clango. Bingo Bango. That's what I said. Ta-ta! This is my chance to hear Bingo Dingo's music before the party. <laughs> It was nice of Griselda to go get Bingo Bango for us. It was, wasn't it? Maybe a bit too nice. <laughs> On behalf of the Rainbow King, I bid you welcome Blingo Bongo. Well, thank you. Huh? What? No, no, not you. Uh, uh. Oh, how nice. Fergie, stop! Uh. <laughs> Thanks, little doggy. Oh, it's you! Finally! Yep, the name is Bingo B -b -b Bango. <laughs> Hello, Blingo Blongo. Oh, it's Bingo Bango. That's what I said. And I'm Griselda. We're all excited to have you play your music at the Super Duper Dance Party. Sweet. I'm a little nervous, but I'm ready for it. Don't worry, when I'm dancing to your music, all eyes will be on me. Oh, cool. I guess. Now, let's go to my grand hall where I, 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 I mean we, can practice. You want it? I want to hear what you've got. <laughs> wow, the Coliseum looks so great now. Yep, we decorated our hearts out. The balloons are up, the streamers are ready, the scratching post is out. You know, for whoever feels like scratching. Okay, that last one's just for me. Oh, wait! I know what we forgot! What? Nap time! <laughs> Fishy poof crackers. <laughs> Griselda should be back with Bingo Bango soon. I'll wake you then. Now, Grismos, pretend you're the crowd just watching, and I walk out into the stage. Got it? Music! Stop, stop, stop! Can you please play something that I can dance to, but won't make everyone else want to dance? Uh. From the top! <laughs> Ugh, nobody!
nobody can dance to that. Not even a great dancer like me. I am supremely annoyed. I'm sorry. If I can't play for a great dancer like you, well, then maybe I'm... A terrible DJ. I'm sure you can do better. You certainly don't want to disappoint the Rainbow King and all those people at the party. Okay, you can start the music again. Hit it! Wingo Klingo? Rude. <sighs> I was having the sweetest dream about my fishy poof crackers when you woke me. Yeah, they were dancing right on the tip of my tongue. Oh, fishy poof crackers. So fishy. So poofy, so crackery. Your dream sounds tasty. Oh, we have a problem. Griselda and Bingo Bango didn't show up at the Coliseum, and I don't see them here. I spy with my kitten eye something that is huh, Bingo Bango shaped. He's leaving. Stop! Wait, Bingo Bango! Bingo Bango! Bingo Bango! Wait, come back! True, stop that! Well, that's just great. Now we don't have any DJ for the Super Duper Dance Party. Mm. What happened? Why didn't you meet Bingo Bango? I did meet him. He came to my castle to practice, but he didn't play very well at all. Really? That doesn't sound like him. Then he said he was a terrible DJ and ran off. Just like that. Where are we going to find another DJ? I don't think we need another DJ. We just need to help Bingo Bango feel better. We need some wish help. Cue Milo. Hi, Hi Cue Milo. Are you ready to take us to the wishing tree? <laughs> then let's go. Greetings, True and Bartleby. What's that you're using? This is my wishoscope. It lets me see inside a wish to learn more about its temperament. Temper, huh? The type of personality it has. See? This wish has a bubbly center. That means it loves to laugh. Observe. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Wish. So are you both ready for the Super Duper Dance Party? Not really. Our DJ Bingo Bango left. Oh no. You can't have music without a DJ. Let's take a moment. <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> <sighs> so, why did Bingo Bango leave? Griselda said he wasn't playing very well. And when we saw him, he looked really upset. Yeah, he even told Griselda he was a terrible DJ. Hmm. It sounds like Bingo Bango has lost his confidence. Confidence, of course. Confidence. Yeah, yeah what's confidence? <laughs> it's when you know you can do something well. So if I feel like I'm really good at doing kitty natty jump spin kicks... Then you have confidence. Yes, I do! Jump and spin and kick! <laughs> <laughs> But if Bingo Bango feels like he can't play music anymore... Then he's lost his confidence. We have to help him get it back. I'm also great at doing jump and spin and... <laughs> falls. <laughs> nice moves, Bartleby. Confidence. I think putting Bingo Bango in a good mood would be a great first step. And he was so quiet when we saw him, he might need something to help him be louder. And remember, he needs to get his beat back. Those are all important for a DJ. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Magic 
reading more about them. Let's check the Wishopedia. Hmm. Ah, yes. Here it is. Shim Shim is exceptional at oscillating. Oscillating? That means its long, wiggly arms can shimmy all over the place. That's great. We want to cheer Bango Bango up. So I'll get Shim Shim to wiggle until Bingo Bango giggles. <laughs> I'm sure it won't take long. Now your second wish. Ah. Here, Pom Pom. It can make the quietest whispers very loud. <laughs> the perfect wish for a quiet DJ. What? Buffet? Is it all you can eat? <laughs> <laughs> Where is your third wish? Ah, here it is. Bee Paw. It's all about bouncing at different speeds and different patterns. Hmm, I don't know how bouncing will help Bingo Bango feel better. But I'm happy to give it a try. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. <laughs> Come on, Bartleby. Let's find Bingo Bango and help get his confidence back. Yay! You're the best, Z. Good luck. There's Bingo Bango! Uh-oh, it looks like he's heading into the never-ending forest. We have to stop him. Oops. I know just what to say to cheer him up. Bingo Bango? Z Bingo Bango? It's you! We really love your music. Why? Well, I'm a terrible DJ. Okay, that did not cheer him up. My name is Stu, and this is Bartleby. We came to bring you to the Super Duper Dance Party. Oh, I can't play there. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yikes. We really need to do something. Time to use my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Shim Shim! Wish come true! <laughs> Okay, Shim Shim, can you do a little jiggle wiggle to make Bingo Bango giggle? <laughs> it's not working. Let's try again. Wiggle bigger, Shim Shim. <laughs> I'm wiggling like jelly. It's shaking my belly. It's a wiggle. -off. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. <laughs> I'm giggly and jiggly and wiggly and like jello. Whoa, that bump made a really fun sound. Well, let me try. Yeah, great sound. Ba boom, boom, boom. That gives me an idea. Bingo Bango loves musical sounds. If we make more, maybe that will cheer him up. Cool. <laughs> I know you're trying not to laugh. Come on. I see a little smile. Let's make it bigger. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, <laughs> you got me. Woo! You made me laugh even though I didn't want to. <laughs> You're good. Thanks. You too, Shim Shim. Way to wiggle. Time to go back in the pack. Are you feeling better now? <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Enough to start playing music at the Super Duper Dance Party? Uh, I don't know why I want to, but what if I... I'm really terrible. Why don't you try making music right here? No crowds, just us. Okay, uh, here goes. That's it, you can do it. <laughs> I can't, I'm terrible, I can't do it. Oh no, Bingo Bango, wait. No, stop following me. I see him, he's hiding behind a tree. I've been a tree hider many, many times. It's not a good sign. Bingo Bango, that was a good start. You just have to warm up a little. 
playing music is what you do best. What I used to do best? Now I'll just disappoint everyone. His confidence is still really low. Is it ever? How can we get him to play at the dance party if we can't even get him to play for us? <gasps> Not for us, with us! Come on! Ooh, great sound! When I strummed Shim Shim, Bingo Bangle joined in and made his own sounds. If we play a whole song, maybe he'll join in again. Great idea, True. Let's make some music. Said, whoa. <laughs> Sounds like we need more practice. Mm -hmm. We need someone. Someone to give us a beat to play to. <gasps> Wait, I have an idea. My bee polish can help us keep a beat by jumping up and down. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, bee paw. <laughs> Wish come true! <laughs> Beepa, are you ready to make a beat that helps us move our feet? Uh-huh. All right, Beepa, let's see you jump. <laughs> whoa, whoa, maybe not so fast. Can you jump to a regular beat? Boom, 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 boom. Oh, yeah! Look at you go! First, well, I don't know how to get there. <laughs> wow, listen to that crowd. Sounds like they're ready to dance. Are you ready to make them dance, Bingo Bango? Well, I think so. Um, maybe I... Yes! Yes! Well, I'm ready! Yes! Wait! No! On second thought, no! You're still not ready to play at the party? I was ready for that, but no, I'm not so sure. Oh, hello, Jingo Clango. It's Bingo Bango. That's what I said? You came back. <laughs> I guess the Super Duper Dance Party has a DJ after all. I don't know. Some people think I'm not good enough. Griselda, when you told Bingo Bango he couldn't play well, he believed you and oh. felt really <laughs> bad about it. He did? I didn't mean to make him feel bad. But if he doesn't want to play, no biggie. I brought my own DJ to the dance party. Okay, Forky, drop the beat. <laughs> Anytime now. Forky Wookiekins, I know you can do this. Please. <laughs> He should stick to drooling. He's good at that. Ugh. Okay, fine. Have what's-his-name play and let everybody dance. Yay! I just wanted all eyes to be on me. Aww. Aww. Griselda! Everyone likes to dance, but when we all dance together, that's when we have the most fun. I'm sorry to tell everyone. There isn't going to be a dance party. Huh? What? Rainbow King, what's wrong? Look! 
We don't have a crowd. Oh, no. So that noise we heard before, it wasn't people coming into the Coliseum. It was people leaving. <laughs> when Bingo Bango didn't show up, they decided to go home. Great clouds. There's nothing super duper about this. Bingo Bango's here, Your Majesty. We can save this party. But how true? There's nobody left. You're the only one who can save the super duper dance party, Bingo Bango. Can you do it? Save the party. Yes, I can. Dance, 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 Maybe they can't hear you. Don't worry, I've got this. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Pom Pom! Pom Pom! Wish come true! <laughs> okay, Pom Pom, are you ready to pump up the volume? Mm-hmm. Let's send this music all across the kingdom! Super Duper Dance Party! Thanks, True! I couldn't have gotten back on stage without your help. Yep. Any minute now, everybody will be dancing. It would help if someone got them started. <laughs> Look, you've got fans! You were right, True. Dancing with others is fun! Great dancing, Gazelda! <laughs> now this is what I call a super duper dance party! Thank you, True! Happy to help, Your Majesty! I am awesome! Great job, Bartleby! <laughs> hey, I forgot you were in there, True. Sorry. <laughs> Thanks a lot, B. Just setting up the sleeping bags. It's so beautiful out here. There's nothing better than going... Uh -huh. Glamping! Glamping? <laughs> Glamorous camping. Everyone named Griselda is glamping these days. I still can't believe she agreed to come with us. There's dirt here. <laughs> you know camping is supposed to be roughing it, right? Oh, believe me, I know. I didn't even pack my sparkly bubble wash. Isn't that right, Froogie? Oh, a puppy? Just the helper I need to find my long-lost treasure. <laughs> Want a snack? I brought... Sparkly sandwiches? Who packed these? Those are glam witches. They're tasty and gorgeous. Just ask my fruity kins. He loves them. Nibbles time. <laughs> Fruki, glampers don't scamper. Hey. Be Foo, fluffy, there's nothing better than a puppy, puppy, a puppy, I say. So fluffy and sniffy, snuffing out treasure in a jiffy. Come get your glam witch. <laughs> Ooh, true puddles. He definitely went in here. No, my snuggle pops will get lost in this big, horrible, nasty. Maze, it's a maze. And it isn't nasty, it's breathtaking. And you can't go in! Hey, Bartleby! Don't worry, True. I'll find a little drill machine in here. Somewhere. 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 Who 
are you? Oh, clearly you've never heard of a maze troll before. We're meanies. Though, when I'm not guarding this maze, I'm actually quite nice. Why would anyone build something so unglamorous? <laughs> to hide my precious treasure from those who would try and steal it. But now my precious treasure's in there. For good reason. Between you, me, and the tree, I built this maze so big and tricky that no one can find my treasure. <laughs> Not even me. But a dog with nose powers, oh, your puppy pooch will find my treasure for sure. Mr. Troll, both our friends are in there now. We have to find them. <sighs> Fine. But the only way to enter my maze is to solve a riddle. How many berries from these baskets of plenty can you eat before your stomach is no longer empty? Oh, I'll find out. Wait, Griselda, we have to count them as you eat one by one. By one? <gasps> the answer is one. What? That can't be right. I've eaten way more than one berry. The riddle said, how many berries can you eat before your stomach's no longer empty? If you eat one berry, it's not empty anymore. Riddle sticks. That is correct. Oh, you may enter. <laughs> but first, let me give you a sneak peek inside. Whoa. Whoa. Fantastic, isn't it? <laughs> one hallway becomes more hallways. Then doors begin popping up. And pretty soon, everything's all twisty and turny. And where will that leave you to? Hopelessly! <laughs> As I said, you are free to enter. But that doesn't mean you can stay in. Ooh, <laughs> I just gave myself a shiver saying that. <laughs> I am such a good meanie. What do we do, True? We'll never find Fruki and Bartleby in that maze. Don't worry, Griselda. We'll get them out of there. But we need some wish help to do it. If you're going to the wishing tree, then I'm coming too. You bet you are. The only way we can do this is if we do it together. Oh, Cumula! <laughs> to the wishing tree, Cumulo! <laughs> True, Griselda. The Wishes and I are camping. These three have even earned their merit badges. Camping sure is fun. Are we still talking about that? Camping was so five minutes ago. We're actually not here about camping. We're here about a maze. A maze? Ooh, I love puzzles. It sounds like fun. It's a giant maze that Fruki and Bartleby are trapped in. Oh, that's a lot less fun. Let's sit and have a think about this. No thanks. Princesses don't sit on mushrooms. Ah, put me down! Stay calm. Ah! Shh, shh. You'll be okay. The mushroom will come back down. Eventually. How can the wishing tree help, True? Well, this maze is really tricky. Ah! With walls that move around and everything. Ah! We need a wish that can keep us from getting lost. Help! I'm stuck up here! Stuck? Yes! If we get stuck in the maze, we'll need a wish to help us get unstuck. Thanks, Griselda. Ah! You're welcome. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. No way. 
these are some fantastic wishes. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Your first wish uh, is dot spot. It can make as many dots as you need. Perfect. We can use dot spot to find our way back out of the maze so we don't get lost. We'll just follow the dots. Polka dots are fabulous. This is a wish with style. Your second wish is rope a room. This rope wish is a great help for when you need to climb things or to tie things together. That might be handy for pulling us out of a tricky spot. And lastly, you have Slothby. A rare and oh. unusual wish indeed. This wish can put anything into slow motion. That's incredible! <laughs> I'm just not sure how slowing things down can help save our friends. I'm sure you'll find a way, True. I have to agree. And I'm always right. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Bye, Z! Have fun with your camping whatever. Good luck, you two. I'm sure you'll do amazing. <laughs> Fruky! Fruky! Whoa, what's up with that? How do I get out of here? I should warn you, my ninja kitty skills are set for awesome. Fruky! Oh, am I happy to see you! Yeah, was happy to see you. Ugh. Okay, now careful where you step around here. This maze is filled with booby traps. Run! And we're trapped. Thanks, Q Milo. Hey! Get back here! Fruki, we have to get out of this maze! Here, okay, give, give, give me a boost. Fruki, this is no time to be sitting on your behind. <laughs> yeah! I take it back. Your behind is the best. <laughs> Did you hear that? That's Bartleby! We're going the right way! But how do we keep going the right way? There's so many hallways! We'll work together to find the right ones. But before we can go any further, let's make sure we can find our way back out of this maze. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, dark spot! Wish come true! Dot spot. Can you leave a trail of dots behind us as we walk? Rubber-doo! Sparkly pink? It's like he knows me. Fruki, where are you? Bartleby! Boo! Oh. Very clever. The nice troll part of me would just leave these dots. But I need that dog to find my long-lost treasure, so... Mean troll it is! We've been walking forever! Why does this keep happening? Griselda, look! You've fallen here before! That means we've been here before! We're walking around in circles! No way! How is that possible? I don't know. Dot Spot's still dotting, so we should have known. <laughs> Unless the troll's been stealing our dots! Oh, he is a big meanie. Without those dots to show us where we've been, we'll never get back out. We'll solve that problem later. Right now, we have to stop the troll from stopping us. Dot Spot, can you make us one big giant dot? Rabadoo! <laughs> Thanks, Dot Spot. That troll's gonna have fun trying to pick up this dot. 
Come on. <laughs> huh? A big dot? Like that? <laughs> Stop me! Oh, oh, oh. Spooky, hold on. We'll never get out of this maze if we get stuck. Okay, I'll go first, then you. <laughs> what did I just say? <laughs> It's just a door painted like a troll. Eee! Ah, troll! Oh, just another freaky troll door. This one's worse than the last. I get that a lot. Ah! To keep going through my maze, you need to answer another riddle. If you don't solve the riddle by the time this bird bath sinks into the floor, you must leave my maze forever! Ah! Riddle us your riddle, Mr. Troll. We're ready. Ahem. It's the part of the bird that's not in the sky. It can go in the bird bath, and yet it stays dry. What is it? Whoa! It can go in the bird bath, yet it stays dry. Maybe it's a smelly armpit. Oh, I can't get a good look at it. Quick, try catching it. Fire! Oh, this bird is too quick. We have a better chance of catching its shadow. Shadow? The bird is in the sky, but its shadow is on the ground. And its shadow can go in the bird bath and not get wet. I know what the answer is. It's shadow. Riddle sticks. Right again. You may pass again, but I'll be around every corner to give you more riddles until you finally give up. See you soon. I mean, see you soon. How are we ever going to stop this troll from stopping us? Let's think about this. We need to get away from him, but he knows this maze inside out. Yeah, he's sneaky. We just have to slow him down enough so we can catch up to Fruki and Bartleby. And I have just the wish. Sloppy. Guess who's back? Hold that thought. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Sloppy. Wish come true. Hi, Sloppy. Let's put the brakes on this riddle, ridiculous troll. <laughs> huh? Here's your next riddle. What jumps in the air? <laughs> Stay with him, Slothby, and keep him nice and slow. Thanks! <laughs> this way. Whoa. You couldn't have waited until I went through first? Princess is uh. first! You know that! <sighs> Fruki's collar! <laughs> Remind me to add this to the Grismo's laundry list. <laughs> Fruki! Where are you, my smelly collar kins? Smelly's with me! Over here! Wherever here is! Bartleby, we're coming! <laughs> Must block them! Fruki, we're coming! Uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bartleby! <laughs> <laughs> what is with this crazy maze? So frustrating! <laughs> Fruki, now is not the time for... Wait, your behind saved us last time? Keep going! Work that tail, boy! <laughs> you did it! Uh-oh! Ah! Fruki! Bartleby? True! I am so glad to see you! Did you miss me? <laughs> of course, Bartleby. Are you two okay? Yes, but we're trapped down here and Fruki's thinking about giving more drooly kisses. <laughs> Help! We'll get you out right away. Oh. Sloppy. Oh no, you're out of power. That must
trust me? <gasps> yes, it's me again. No more riddles for you two. I'm kicking you both out of my maze. Now! Hold on. This pit. I remember now. This is where I buried my treasure. <laughs> the doggy found it! My magic shillelagh! Riddle sticks. I can't get them out of that pit without my shillelagh. I am not leaving this awful maze without my Fruga kids. Do you understand me? Yes. Wow, you'd make a really good maze troll, you know that? Oh, don't worry. I have a wish that can help get everyone out of there. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Robert! Wish come true! Hi, Roboru. I need your roping help to pull our friends out of this pit. Can you help us? Oh, sure. Rope, 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 rope! Grab on, you two! Got it! Why are we moving? Fruki, let go of that thing! No! It's my treasure! He's got it! Your treasure is no good if our friends can't bring it up because they're stuck down there! Oh, this is all my fault. I need to fix this. I'm coming to save you, Poochie. And me. Yes! Riddle sticks. Now I need a new shillelagh. And I'm not strong enough to do this on my own. Yeah, that dog has jaws of steel. Mr. Troll, we can help each other out of this mess. You oh? want us to work with him? He's been trying to stop us all day. The only way we'll get everyone out is by working together, Griselda. You got it! Ready, Roparoo? Uh -huh. Ready, Griselda? Uh-huh. I wish working together didn't mean having to hold his stinky feet. Ew! I watched them just last year. <laughs> oh, that's never good. <gasps> Uh-oh. No! Grab my hand! Come on, drill machine! Let's go! Pull with me, Roparoo! Treasurekins! Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone! Working together did the trick! I knew it would! Your treasure's a dog bone? Yeah, a dog bone. That's why I needed a puppy to find it. <gasps> you put my precious Fruki through all of this just to get a little glittery dog bone? You are a meanie! <laughs> You're right! I've been such a meanie to you today. It's just to stop people from coming in the maze and getting lost. I hope you can forgive me. Ah, <laughs> oh, here, this is for you. You kept saying you were a mean troll, but you can be a nice one, too. You just gave your treasure to my oh. treasure. <laughs> How can I resist this little cutie? I suppose it wouldn't hurt if you visit Fruki now and then. Really? Oh, thank you, thank you! Princess Group Hug! Oh. Uh, how are we gonna get out of here? What's glamping? It's sparkly. You'll like it. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> Great Grismos! <laughs> Hello, Marshmallow Bartleby. Hello, Drew. Quack, 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 meow. <gasps> Look, a box. Cats love boxes. 
But cats love yarn even more. Yarn? Did you say yarn? <laughs> Uh-oh. What's gonna happen to the marshmallow Bartleby? Delicious. True. You're eating marshmallow me. I couldn't help it. You're just so marshy. And mellowy. I really am. <laughs> yeah. I like the glitter bird you made. Thanks. Oh, boy, you and I made a lot of great art today while it was raining outside. <gasps> Want to take this art party outside? Do I ever! Whoa! Mm. Mm. Whoops. Whoa! Whoa! True, are you all right? I'm okay. I just slipped on a marshmallow. Bad, inconsiderate marshmallow <laughs> for not making it in my mouth. <gasps> True. The door's a mess. What? This looks amazing, Bee. Look how glittery prettily it got. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and now it's even more amazing. <laughs> well, look at that. It matches our house. But glittery. <laughs> Whoa. Dazzling door, True. That's some kind of door. Whoa, dazzling door, True. I think we just started something. I think you're right. <laughs> wow. Look at all the neighborhood doors. They're so dazzling. Ah, this is amazing. So much great art everywhere. Hey, look! That, that's a painting of me! That is the sweetest thing. It's a potato. Oh. <laughs> Looks like everybody's making dazzling doors today, Fruki. Let's see how mine is coming along. Okay, Grismos. Let's see what you made to dazzle your princess with. Grismos, this isn't dazzling enough. We're on a mountaintop. My door has to be so dazzling that people can see it from all across the kingdom. I know, I'll dazzle it with crystals. And not just on the door. I'll build a new tower entirely of crystals that everyone can see. <laughs> Find me the sparkliest crystals you can. And get dazzling! Oh, yeah, sure thing. can't start my day until I get a kitty cuddle from you-know-who. The Rainbow King? I don't know. He's a busy guy. But there's always time for true tickles. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Watch the very tickly. <laughs> I can't wait to see what everyone's doors look like. <laughs> How am I supposed to eat my car and I can't see it? Ah! What's happening? Whoa, this is way too much sun. I cannot believe I'm saying that. A cat? Too much sun? What's happening, True? I have no idea. Wait, look. That glare isn't from the sun. It's from Griselda's castle. Really? I can't see anything. Oh, yeah, there it is. It looks brighter now. Shinier. We've got to go up there and find out what's going on. Rain or sun, this blocks them both. Yep, I'm ready. Cue Milo, here, buddy, come on! Cue Milo, you poor thing. Is the sun 
sun hurting your eyes, too? <laughs> it's hard to fly when it's this bright out, huh, Cumulo? Here you go, buddy. Yeah, suits you better anyways. Let's go to Griselda's castle, please. <laughs> Cumulo. Fruki, we've talked about this. No drooling. It's a lot of love. Far too moist. <laughs> Are you here to give me the award for the most dazzling castle? Nothing could be as sparkly as my new crystal covered tower. Um, no. This wasn't a competition. How can it not be? Everyone is doing it. So, what's the prize? A ribbon? A trophy? Wait, is it a crown? Sorry, there's no crown. A tiara, then? Nope. Not even a hair clip? No. <sighs> oh, well. But don't you just love it? My castle is the most dazzling home ever! It is, but your new tower is reflecting so much light, it's blinding the entire kingdom. Oh, so everyone can see my crystal sparkling? If it's too bright for some people, they can just wear sunglasses like you. <gasps> What was that? D did your castle just sink? Uh, my castle? Um, uh, don't be silly. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to watch my Grismos put on even more gorgeous crystals. Toodles! Hey. Oh, hi there, little Grismo. Oh, man. Huh? Uh, I'm broke. You want us to go down there? Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I think that's a yes. Uh, last one. Last one. Uh, right here. Yeah, right there. Whoa! You live right beneath Griselda's castle? How cute! You know, not the most cat-friendly furniture, though. That's just an observation. Look, B, that pillar is where all the crystals are coming from. Uh... Oh no! Griselda's new crystal tower is getting so heavy that pillar's gonna crumble. That's what you wanted to show me. Uh -huh, uh -huh. You poor little Grismos. Oh no! Uh... Whoa! Gotcha. <laughs> Griselda's castle is sinking, and we're right under it. Everybody, let's get out of here before that pillar breaks! Single file, Grismos, this is not a drill. Okay, Grismos, the new crystal tower is making the castle too heavy, and now the castle is sinking into your home. <laughs> but don't worry, we'll convince Griselda to take off the crystals right away. We have to. So right. <laughs> My beautiful castle. Griselda! Griselda! True! True! My castle is sinking! Why? It's because your crystals are... Wait! Wait, 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 wait! Don't tell me! Princesses hate bad news. Okay, I won't tell you. Bartleby will. <coughs> it's because of all the crystals you put on it. No! <laughs> Are you done? Oh. <sighs> okay, now I'm done. You have to take the crystal tower down. It's just too heavy. But their sparkle's so sparkly. I really, really love it. I know you do, but if you don't take the tower down, your castle will sink into the Grismo's home. And crush it. <laughs> no! True, she's doing it again. Griselda! Sorry, it's not my fault. I never knew where my Grismos lived. That's okay. Bartleby and I will try to hold the castle up while you and the Grismos take the crystals down. Good luck! I'll try, but I can barely see it's so bright out here. Why is it so... All oh, right, <laughs> that was me. All right, Grismos, let's get stacking. Make it as high as you can! To hold it up. We're almost to the ceiling. Keep going, hurry. True, we're running out of big things to stack up. Uh, then you small things. That's a great idea. Wait, hey, 
more small things! Phew. We did it! Success! We propped up the ceiling and saved the day, and the history books shall reflect this. Whoa! <laughs> Okay, maybe saved wasn't the right word. Let's get everyone out of here. Grismos, we have to go outside. All right, Grismos, you know the deal. Hop to left, right, here we go. We tried everything we could. Now we need some wish help. Cumulo! To the wishing tree! Oh, sorry about that. Are you and the wishes okay? Oh, yes. <laughs> I was just testing to see how high they can bounce. Bouncy good fun. It is. But that bright light really startled the wishes. That's the problem. It's from Griselda's castle. She built a crystal tower so tall and heavy, it's sinking into the Grismo's home. Great gravity. That is a problem. Come sit down, and we'll figure this out. <gasps> so how do you plan to fix this? Well, we need something to stop the glare outside while we work. Wait, no more sunglasses? Aw, I was just getting used to looking like a cool cat. Uh, you know, an even cooler cat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bartleby. We need to hold up the castle so it doesn't crush the Grismo's home. Not forever, but long enough to take down the crystal tower and put the crystals back where they belong. Sounds like you know exactly what you need to do. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. What a fascinating group of wishes. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about them. Your first wish is Tip Top. It is a stacking wish made of smaller parts that work together to build bigger structures. Hey, they look like little acrobats. They'll work perfectly for holding up the Grismo ceiling. Now for wish number two. Ah, yes, Zeppelo. It can hold hot air inside its body and expand as it rises. Hmm, maybe he can help get us high up on the tower to help take off the crystals. And the last wish you have is... Slipsy. It is a slide wish. Not only can you slide down it, you can also slide up. What a unique specimen. I've never slid up a slide before. I'm just not sure how it can help me with Griselda's castle. Ah, uh, you'll, you'll think of something. You're a good thinker. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Okay, bye, Z. Good luck. Let's do this. Okay, B. First, we have to prop up the ceiling to stop the Grismo's home from caving in. Time for Tip Top. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! 
Wake up, Tip Top! Wish come true! <laughs> Tip Top gets stucky! Oh my gosh, they're so cute! <laughs> are tougher than they look. Tip top job, tip top. Now that they're holding up the castle, let's go help Griselda take the crystals down. Griselda, how's it going up there? Ah, not great. My Grismals can't see what they're doing. We need something to block the sun. Yeah, and it would need to be, hmm, huge. Zeppelo gets huge. Let's block some light. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Zeplo! Oh. Wish come true! <laughs> okay, Zeplo, time to get huge! Wow, you're humongous! Oh. That tail! <laughs> Whoa! Hmm, where should Zeplo be to block the light? Um, little help. Ah, <laughs> gotcha. Whoa! Come on, Bartleby! <laughs> this way, Zeplo! <sighs> it's working, Bartleby! It's wobbling. No, that's just me. So dizzy. Okay, let's hurry and get the rest of those crystals down and back where they... We better check on Tip Top. can't hold up the castle forever. We've got to get the crystals in here faster and rebuild the pillar. <laughs> Hurry, Grismos! We have to We're on our way. Here we go. Uh, he's he's here we go. Here we go. Yeah. I'm not sure how much faster they can go. They're pooped. <laughs> <laughs> What now, True? This gives me an idea. One Grismo got down here faster by sliding on a crystal. Hmm. If we get Slipsy near the tower, we can move a lot of crystals down here faster. Slipsy, let's do some sliding. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Slipsy! Wish come true! Hi, Slipsy. Hi. I need you to make a slide all the way to the top of Griselda's castle. Woohoo! Go, Slipsy! <laughs> Come on, Bartleby! But we're at the bottom. Z told us that we could slide down or up on Slipsy. Remember? Now this I gotta try! Let's slide! Up we go, Slipsy! Curve around! And around, and around. <clears throat> True, this is no time for playing. It's not for us. It's to help bring the crystals back under the castle. Okay, everyone, put the crystals onto Slipsy and he'll slide them down fast. Whoa. <clears throat> <clears throat> <laughs> That's it, Grismos! <laughs> now, don't get too excited, guys. They did it! Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> hey, look! They're putting the crystals back and rebuilding the pillar. Yeah. 
for working so hard, Tip Top. You can rest now. <laughs> Great job, Slipsy and Zeplo. We couldn't have done it without you. Yay! <laughs> Perfect! True! You saved my castle! I guess I got a little carried away trying to outdo everyone's dazzling doors. A little carried away? I know it wasn't a competition, but I did want to win. Yeah, but you also wanted to help your Grismos. That's what counts. <laughs> if you still want to add a little dazzle to your door, we have a surprise for you! <gasps> oh, it's perfect! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Not again! <gasps> A cake for me? It's so beautiful! Now, let's get this party Griselda grooving! 